All right, you guys, let's review our warm up. I'm gonna start first by doing the number lines. We're focusing on adding and subtracting on the number lines and using the standard algorithm. So first we'll do 9,427 minus 2,751. What I wanna do is I want to expand the second number. So if I expand this number, now I'll know how to do my loops. I'm starting at 9,427, which is right here. Since I'm subtracting, I'm going backwards. We're gonna go one loop, which represents minus 2,000. So we're subtracting based on place value. First, we're gonna take away the 2,000. 9,427 minus 2,000, which would be 7,400. 27 because I just took the 2,000 from the thousands place. Next up, 700. Let's loop over, make our minus 700. And this one could be a little tricky because we're going to have to go down a thousand too. But let me show you. So we have to take away 700 from the hundreds place. But as we see, it's only four hundreds there, so we're going to have to end up borrowing. So what we're going to do is we're going to count down 400. 327, 227, 127, 27. Now we're at 6,927, 6,827, 6,727, 6,727. Then we're going to subtract 50. So now we're taking 50, we're taking five away from this side. Obviously we don't see, we, we see we don't have as much, so we're gonna have to borrow. So we just count down, and the teacher students to count down by 10. So we're at 27, 727, 717, 70, 707, 697, 687, 677. So this would be 6,677. I hate that it's so close. 6,677. And then the last thing we have to take away is our one. Minus one, which is 6,676, which would be your answer. So what we did was we subtracted each place value we made all of our loops and we labeled our loops to show how much we actually went back by. And then we got to our answer. Now let's come over here and check our answer. So we have to do our standard algorithm. Seven minus one, we see that's pretty obvious. That's six. This two minus five, which is really 20 minus 50. Well, we can't take five away from this two. So I've been teaching students to add one, take one away. 12 minus five is seven. Three minus seven, we can't do it. We add one, take one away. 13 minus seven is six. Eight minus two is six. We see now that we have the same answer on both sides. The goal is that we teach the students how to subtract both ways using standard algorithm and the number line.